the United States has an immigration system that hasn't changed much since the 1960s. However, the number of immigrants has grown from 5 million to nearly 44 million. According to the think tank Migration Policy Institute, nearly 30% are unauthorized immigrants, and most of them have been here for at least a decade. So why don't they just get in line, you may ask? Well, one reason for most unauthorized immigrants, there is no line. If you don't have an immediate family member here with permanent status, getting a green card is really hard. You could try immigrating through your work or profession, but visas are really limited, and even more so for low-skilled jobs. You can also apply for humanitarian protection, but the U.S. caps the number of refugees, and the asylum process is extremely complex and stringent. Or you can try to win a visa in a lottery system, but good luck with that. While some government officials claim unauthorized immigrants are flooding into the U.S., the fact is illegal border crossings hit a 46-year low after the election of Donald Trump. The president's aggressive approach to immigration enforcement may be having a short-term effect, but may not do much in the long run.